Joseph Fritzl's daughter Elizabeth's first words out of captivity released. The chilling first words spoken by Elizabeth Fritzl after she was released from the underground cellar she was kept in for 24 years have been released. In a new documentary for UK's Channel 5 called Fritzl, What Happened Next, the police chief behind the criminal investigation into Elizabeth's ordeal speaks out. Wibald Reitner recounted that when he first interviewed Elizabeth after her release, she stayed silent. He says Elizabeth thought nobody would believe her story of 24 years captivity and rape by her father, Joseph Fritzl. Elizabeth didn't say anything. She said, no one will believe me anyway, Mr. Reitner recounted. Then we changed our attack and we told her, well, maybe you are the victim? Suddenly Elizabeth had a different expression about her. After that she said, if I tell this exactly how it all happened, no one will ever believe me. Fritz, now 82, was jailed for life in 2009 after being found guilty of murder over the death of one of Elizabeth's babies, as well as incest, and 3,000 counts of rape. His crimes were uncovered when the oldest cellar child, a 19-year-old girl, became seriously ill. Elizabeth begged her father to take the girl to hospital and later that day doctors quickly alerted police to Fritzl's home after questioning the teenager who had never been in the outside world before. Elizabeth, now 51, reportedly lives with her six surviving children at a secret location in Austria. Mark Perry, who first broke the story of the crime, has also been interviewed for the new documentary. He says Fritzl believes his prison stint is temporary. Fritzl is still in prison of course, and he still dreams of coming free. That's what the solicitor told me. He still thinks he'll come free one day, go fishing and, and carry on with life.